In this tutorial we will see how to generate PWM using CCP module of PIC microcontroller. I hope that you already know about PWM and its applications. Now, let's see how the CCP module of PIC microcontroller is working as PWM generator. This is the block diagram of CCP module working as PWM generator. Time period of the generated waves are determined by the value in the PR2 register and duty cycle is determined by the value in the CCPR1L register and 5th 4th bits of CCP1CON register. Time base for PWM is generated by timer 2 module of PIC microcontroller. So TMR2 register is working as free running counter. CCPR1H register will latch the value of duty cycle during start of every cycle. This will avoid possibility of glitches in the output to sudden change in duty cycle value. For the sake of explanation we simplify the diagram like this. Now let's see the working by loading duty cycle and time paroid register. Output goes zero when the duty cycle value matches with timer value. Here we changed the duty cycle during this process, but it will come effective only during next cycle as it is to be get latched to CCPR1H register. This will avoid glitches in the PWM output. When the TMR2 value becomes equal to the time period value the cycle resets and loads duty cycle from the CCPR1L register. In this circuit four switches are provided to control the duty cycle of two PWM channels. You can get the source code and its explanation from our website electrosome.com. Now let's see the output of our PWM experiment. In this experiment you can see that the LED brightness is changing with PWM duty cycle. Thanks for watching. Please visit our website electrosome.com.